Zonia's Rainforest, written and illustrated by Caldecott Honor winner Juana Martinez Neal. Zonia's Rainforest. Zonia lives with those she loves in the rainforest, where it is always green and full of life. Every morning, the rainforest calls to Zonia. Every morning, Zonia answers. In Zonia's rainforest, green and full of life, she visits old friends and meets new ones. Good morning, she says one, two, three, four times. She stops to talk with some chatty new neighbors. Welcome, I live next door. Zonia sings. She says hello to her most playful friend. You are my favorite, she whispers. If she is lucky, her fastest friend will invite her for a short ride through the thicket. We are mighty, Zonia says, for that is what she feels in her heart. Zonia sees a colorful couple swim by. How's the water today? She asks with a smile. She congratulates mamas with their new babies. Oh, I can't wait for you to meet my baby brother. I love him so much. Zonia loves playing hide and seek. Five, six, seven, eight, she counts. Some friends help Zonia see the world in new ways. And Zonia knows just who to visit when she wants to be quiet and still. After visiting all of her friends, Zonia is ready to go home. She can't wait to see her mama and baby brother again. On her way home, Zonia comes across something she has not seen before. Frightened, she runs the rest of the way home. Mama, look! Zonia says and opens her hands. The forest needs help. It is speaking to you, says Zonia's mama. Then I will answer, says Zonia, as I always do. We all must answer. The Ashaninka people. Altogether, the Amazon basin is home to more than 500 indigenous nations, some of which remain uncontacted or live in voluntary isolation. Zonia is Ashaninka, understood to be one of the largest indigenous nation, if not the largest, in Peru. The land occupied by the Ashaninka spans a vast region of the Amazon River basin, with the greatest concentration in Peru and in five distinct areas of Brazil. Their language, also called Ashaninka, is the most widely spoken Amazonian language in Peru. The Ashaninka have a long history of being disenfranchised and forced from their homelands. They have just as long as, long a history of resistance and of fighting for self-determination. Much like Zonia, they are answering the call to protect the rainforest, their home, through activism, community organization, and legal action. Ironically, indigenous peoples contribute least to the global climate, climate crisis, yet are the ones most acutely and directly impacted by it. At times, the Ashaninka use plant-based paint on their faces or bodies to complement their actions or abilities. Varying from family to family, the designs are understood as being empowering and are sometimes inspired by the markings of animals to reflect their attributes. As she may have learned from her mama, Zonia uses red paint made from achiote on the last page of the story to signal strength and determination. A few facts about the about tropical forest and the Amazon basin. The Amazon rainforest is the largest intact tropical forest in the world and lies within eight different South American countries. Altogether, the Amazon basin is home to about 16% of the world's forest cover 
just over half of the world's primary tropical forests, and about 50% of all land life. The trees in tropical forests take up excess carbon dioxide created by the use of fossil fuels, thereby helping to mitigate, mitigate the effects of global ch climate change. Amazon forested countries lost an average of 8.6 million acres, or the 13,500 square miles of forest cover every year between 2010 and 2019. Threats to the Amazon rainforest. Illegal logging, farming, mining, oil extraction. The end.